Giving a child the wrong dose of medication can be life-threatening. Now imagine a first responder trying to save a child's life while also trying to figure out how much and what type of medicine should be given. News 13's Peyton Lo Cicero tells us a local fire department is the first in northwest Florida to use a new program that will eliminate the stress and be more accurate. I absolutely feel like this is going to save lives. Prompt, competent, and caring response in time of need is what South Walton Fire District strives for every day. We're always trying to better our EMS services. The pressure on medical professionals is all the more busy when the patient is a child and requires medication immediately. South Walton Fire District has found a way to reduce some of that pressure. The new program is called hand heavy. Once we found out about the system, did the research and realized how much better it was, we decided to, to make the transition over to it. Instead of fumbling with a tape measure, South Walton Fire District firefighters will now be able to administer a certain dosage of medicine for a child based on their age instead of their height. Now we can look up the child's age before we even get on scene and make a game plan and know how much of each drug we're going to have to draw. Mishler explained that before using the hand-heavy system, they used the Braslow program. It required a lot of math that paramedics had to do on the fly. It takes a lot of the room for error that was there before away. On each one of the fire district's administered phones has an app with the new system that they can use at any time. I'm News 13's Peyton Losisero, Panhandle Strong.